Hi guys, welcome to A Hey Math Group. So today I want to show you how to find the union and the intercept when you have actually two sets. So look how easy this is going to be. Let's say that you have set A, which is 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. And then you have B, which is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Now it is very important. Everything inside the set is called elements. So in this case, uh, set A has one, two, three, four, five. This guy has five elements, okay? Because sometimes they ask you the, the number of elements and B has one, two, three, four, five, six, six elements. Okay, so let's go ahead and figure it out how to find the union and how to find the intersection. Now, remember, union is like when you get married. Let's say that you have a dog and your wife has a cat or your future wife has a cat. When you do union, everyone needs to live together the cat and the dog so think about that so union is basically going to be all the sets so we're going to start with one then look two is actually repeated on both sets so i just put it once then three because i have three then four then look i have a five then six right finally a and ten so union is everything okay in fact when you have the venn diagram and then you know we're gonna go ahead and build this venn diagram it's just basically what it is on both circles also including the intersection which that's what's that's what we're going to be doing right now now i have the u and you remember this looks like u from union that's the way to identify it when you have the u just like this you know uh, flip that's going to be intersection intersection means what you both have in common well let's see what do we have in common here we have a two in common okay we have a four in common and actually we have a six in common so we have three elements that are in common so the intersection between a and b is going to be two four and six Perfect. If I wanted to do the Venn diagram with these two, okay, the first step is to figure out what is inside the intersection. Let's go ahead and do this a little bit bigger. So it's actually, you know, easier to see, but um, this is very easy to do. So look, we're going to go ahead and do this is A and this is B. The best way of doing this is just to always do the intersection. So in this case, two, four, six. OK, and then remember, A is going to be two, four, six, eight and ten. This is going to be A and then B is going to be one. OK, one, two, three and then four is there and then five. Awesome. So you can see here that with the Venn diagram, which is, uh, you know, when you do the visual representation of either the union or uh, the intersection of two sets, either two or more, either two or more of two se of more than two sets. And it's just a visual representation of how it looks like. So here I can see union is when A and B marry together, get the dog and the cat together. OK, and the intersection is what they have in common, which is this area right here. So I hope that this actually helps you when you have to do sets and stuff like that, you know, especially on tests like the EOC or the GRE or the GMAT. And sometimes they have these type of questions on the, um, you know, on the SAT. We're gonna go ahead and do another video and talk a little bit more about sets with word problems. Please don't forget to watch our other videos also remember, you can Skype with us. And also, thanks so much for learning.